path following the dry valley of Watlows leads to the top of Malham Cove, where there is one of the finest and most extensive outcrops of limestone pavement in the region. The key to understanding how this amazing landscape was formed is to understand the structure of limestone. Limestone is a sedimentary rock made up of the horizontal bedding planes laid down when Britain was uncovered by the tropical sea and the vertical planes. These give the limestone a blocky structure and make it very susceptible to weathering. The main form of weathering is carbonation. This is where carbon dioxide in the rainwater forms a weak carbonic acid. This then reacts with the calcium in the limestone, forming a bicarbonate. This is then washed away by rainwater, leaving behind quartz and clay impurities. This then forms small depressions in the rock. It's a very slow process, but over years, large chunks of rocks are dissolved and this forms the landscape that we see around us. The limestone pavement is made up of the clints, the paving blocks, and the grikes, the gaps. These create a unique habitat, or microclimate, for wild, rare flowers or ferns. A popular saying in the Malham country is you, can, you step on the clints or you break your ankle. Malum Cove is an immense cliff, 72 metres high and 274 metres wide. This impressive feature dominates an idyllic landscape of stone walled fields, rich pastures and meadows a seemingly timeless and enduring natural monument that bears silent witness to the generations of people that come and go. It is hard to believe that in reality this feature has been in existence for just a fleeting moment in Earth's long history.